It will be the first budget by a Labour government in nine years and must contend with unprecedented, unprecedented levels of debt as a result of the COVID-19 pandemic. Chalmers said that rising inflation was the primary influence on how he drafted his economic blueprint. Chalmers told that reporters in Canberra, the budget will focus on cost of living relief, strengthening the economy, and budget repair as well. The previous conservative government had forecast a 78 billion Australian dollar deficit in the current fiscal year in its last budget in March. The new government's forecast more than halves that deficit to 36.9 billion Australian dollars, thanks mainly to higher prices for commodities, including iron ore and coal. Uh, this budget will be solid, sensible, and suited for the times. It will recognise that in a time of extreme global uncertainty, our best defence is a responsible budget at home. It will understand that even though these economic pressures are coming at us from around the world, they're felt most acutely around the kitchen table. So inflation will be the primary influence on the budget that I hand down tonight. The budget has three objectives. Uh, responsible cost of living relief, uh, strengthening the economy, and beginning the hard yards of budget repair. And we will take a really responsible approach to the welcome and substantial improvements in the near term. Uh, that will not make up for uh, the persistent structural spending pressures uh, on the budget. How, how much attention do you think they pay to budget?